when you hear that the National Assembly of Nigeria summoned the man called uh, Idris, a.k.a. Bobriski, and the very dark man to the National Assembly to talk about who paid how much and where Bobriski stayed in the prison and all of that. National Assembly. These are cases that the police is supposed to handle. What we expect the National Assembly to be doing is to invite, if you want to summon somebody, you are supposed to summon someone, someone like uh, Tinubu to come and explain to Nigerians because he appointed himself as the Minister of Petroleum because he knows that it's a lucrative uh, 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 ministry. That was where people like uh, uh, Alison Diaz and he looted. So he felt it was a lucrative uh, uh, ministry. He appointed himself as the Minister of Petroleum. Now we see the problem of fuel in Nigeria. You don't even have a fuel to buy and the price has the price have gone up. On normal circumstances, the National Assembly is supposed to summon Tinubu to come and tell Nigerians about what is going on. You cannot be celebrating the, 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 the private refinery of Dangote. So I wonder what the opposition parties are doing there. What are they doing there? The decoration just talking, yeah, nay, and pocketing money. I expect somebody to move a motion to, to summon Tinubu to explain to Nigerians how he's running the petroleum ministry. And month after month, they promise that, oh, the, re the refinery in, in, uh, in uh, Portacourt will work. It will work in uh, March. It will work in December. It will work in September. Look at where we are. Somebody should summon Tinubu to explain to Nigerians. Not someone in the very dark man and Bobriski. National Assembly? Ah. It's a shame.